Hello, we're the Amaso Fats, and welcome to another episode of Chad's Beer Reviews. Hello, everyone, and we are actually having fun here. Buys the beer and always drive safe. <laughs> <laughs> Whether it's a lager or an ale, whether it's a stout, light, dark, or pale, if you can brew it, Chad can review it, it's time for Chad's Beer Reviews! He's not quite an amateur, not quite a connoisseur, but regardless of the brewer, he's got taste in beer for sure. You can tell just by his guy, his guy is a bona fide beer knife! So whether it's a porter or an IPA, whether it's from Europe or the USA, if you can brew it, Chad can review it. It's time for Chad's Beer Reviews! Hey, welcome to another episode of Chad's Beer Reviews. Outside, another beautiful autumn afternoon here in late October in upstate New York. Hope you can see the foliage or foliage or how, however it's pronounced. Uh, no surprise, if you're a regular reviewer, this is part five of the St. Bernardus Week. This is the the regular St. Bernardus Triple, or Tripel, I don't know how you pronounce it. Uh, got the website right here. It says, this beer with high fermentation has a pale amber color and a flowery, fruity taste with a harmonious balance between sweet and sour. I think like they all said that, sweet and sour. Um, this beer is a thick and vivid froth and striked by its balanced taste with a delicate bitterness. 8% ABV. And once again, I'm not using the Schmidt glass, I'm going to use a tulip glass. Well, I mean, that's a nice Duval style head right there. On, oh, I don't know, can you guys see that? Oh my god, that is super, super dirty. All the sediments. It looks like a goldfish tank that hasn't been cleaned in like two months. Uh, yeah, so it's, uh, you know, apricot, peach color, gold. Nice, uh, what, three fingers of head there. It's bright white, very foamy. I still have a lot more beer left in the bottle, but that's that's okay. It smells similar to the Watteau, a little bit more boozy. You know, some kind of light fruits, you know, apricot, peach, something like that. Uh, orange peel, let's we'll see how it tastes. Light fruity flavor, a little bit of caramel in the finish, and it actually has a very beer-like taste to it that none of the others have. Getting that caramel candy taste, almost kind of a butterscotch. This one's a lot thicker than the other ones. It's a lot softer in the mouth too. It's not it's not dancing on my tongue, it's not scraping my tongue like some of the other ones. It's a nice, you know, nice mouthfeel on it, you know, not too thick, not too thin, uh, very smooth and despite the high fermentation of all the St. Bernard Spears, this is the one that I'm not burping ever after every swig on, which is nice. This does remind me a little bit of Chimay White. Not nearly as good, but it's it's definitely, you know, a nice solid Belgian triple. Similar to Duval, but without like the the dryness or the pepperiness. It's I would not call this beer dry. And unlike the other St. Bernardus, the, the flavor is not weakening. The body's not becoming thinner or whatever. Um, I'm liking this one. It's just like the other ones where it's like, it's kind of complex, but you can be complex, but not not necessarily robust, and vice versa. I would, I would say it's been true of all these Saint Bernard beers is that they're like fairly complex, but as far as actual intensity of flavor, it's it's really not there. Um, this is a little stronger than the other ones, um, but you know I'm not picking out like a whole lot of flavors like I said kind of a light fruit general taste a touch of spice like coriander orange peel um, like the other ones the drinkability is pretty good it's I, I like it because it's a little it's a little thicker than the other ones 
and not quite as effervescent. Um, so the drinkability and the mouthfeel are definitely better on this one. Yeah, I like it. So I'm going to go one point higher for the triple. I'm going to give this an eight. It's very good beer. And uh, thanks for watching this episode, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Somebody brewed it. Chad just reviewed it. Thanks for watching Chad's beer review. Trust me, the next episode will be a lot better. <laughs> <laughs>